guys, so as you can tell by the tackle boxes out here and the fact of the um, uh, name of this video, you can tell what we're going to be doing. So, I have already rigged up one, which I did not know that my camera was not recording and I'm not doing that again. So, um, it was just this little buzz bait. So, this is the rock. Uh, rod and reel it was on but I currently have the rod collapsed so that we can travel with it without it just poking everyone for like nine hours to Florida and then we have this which is this little buzz weight so now I'm going to be rigging up another uh, rod which is this one so I started to undo it or like unrig it and then I, w I looked at the camera and it didn't say recording and I was like seriously so that's why there's nothing on it that's the end of the line so there's that um, but I have picked one out it was this it's a little bass and the light is not very good here um, but it is a little green bass uh, with this well not with this uh, this one the hole is too small, it looks like, for braided line. Which I don't even know why I put braided line on a little tiny rod like it is. We don't talk about it. Anyway, so we're going to use, not that, but this. So that the hole is bigger and we could probably put braided line through it. So let's try. Nope, okay, let's try. Let's try something. Okay. And then we just put it straight through there. Can you guys see that? No, not really. Okay. Okay, there we go. Got it. Let it out. Okay. And then we don't need a whole ton of uh twisting because it's just a little bass but hey we never you never know we could catch a huge bass on this i mean it'd break my rod but you know it's 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 fine then we just put it straight through that little hole which is not even on camera so that's amazing okay um i messed it up anyway okay well let's go ahead and let some line out just a little bit and then we'll put the rod like that. And now we have more room to work with. All right, so let's try this again. Put that through there, like that. And then do this, and nope, not what I wanted you to do. I know you guys can't see me doing this fisherman's knot because my hands are in the way, but you know, it's fine. Because if you guys know anything about fishing, the first thing you probably uh, need to know if you guys are going to be fishermen or fisherwomen, uh, just how to do a fisherman knot. So, but if you guys don't, there's probably YouTube videos on it. Uh, there's like a bunch of rigs. Texas rig, Car Car Texas rig, Carolina rig, a bunch of stuff. So, and this braided line is amazing because... It's only good for one thing, and that's keeping fish on it and not cutting it. Or, um, see, so that's not what a knot is supposed to look like. That's not what it's supposed to look like. And if you pull it, it's just not moving. Um, uh, I don't know what to do. Okay, um, we're all good. We're all good. Maybe we just move it down. There we go. Got it. Okay. So that's what it's supposed to look like, which you guys still can't see because of the lighting. There we go. It's a little better. Zoom in. Focus? You want to focus? You want to focus? Do you want to focus? Do you want to focus? No, you do not, of course. Okay, well. Sorry that you guys can't see that, but that's... You guys kind of can, I guess. That's what a knot is supposed to look like. So if we just put <laughs> this little hook through this eye, 
No, like that. Okay, and then reel it up so that we don't have that touch line. Okay, there we go. And that's slack. We could just keep on there because it's braided line and I do not feel like getting a knife out. Or well, from this, I guess. Like, there's a bunch of blades on it and I don't want to get those out. But I was just using them for pliers for my other one. Which, of course, like I said, I didn't get on video. But I do have this braided line that was just randomly in my tackle box, which I need to throw away. So we'll put that there. And I know this is a short video, but it's better than not uploading at all like I was for about 15 months. So, put that in there. Put the weight right there. And yeah, I will be in Florida. So, yeah, I'll be vlogging there. And that'll be fun. So, I'll see you guys in Florida. And I want you guys to comment on this video because we're leaving tomorrow morning. So I need to check them tonight. So I want you guys to comment um, whether I should do another going to Florida thing like I did last year. Remember how I just packed everything up in, in the beginning? So I want you guys to vote on that. And if, it, if you guys say yes, I'm going to do it. If you guys say no because you don't want to see that, it's fine. It's whatever. Um, well, then you guys don't want to see it. So I'm not going to make one. So... Post it tonight. I will check it right before I go to bed. And I will see you guys in Florida. Or maybe here.